Hey love bugs, it's Roz, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and how's your favorite and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome into my returning subs, my extended family. Thank you so much for the love and support you send each and every one of us, including myself, each and every day, the blessings and it's just the vibes are very promising and I love that. And you know, keep it going, keep up the great work. Our, you know, our community is just growing so much faster. So thank you so much for showing love. You know, if you've been sharing info about my channel, I'm so grateful for that. You know, just keep it up. I appreciate it. Thank you so much because whatever is going on is working. And so for that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell over there at the bottom you know so you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the positive feedback of the video or you, you just tell me about your you know your story about you being you know the, the impacted impact empathic gift that has been placed upon you <laughs> So all that, if it's all po positive, it's all possible. It's all welcome. So if you feel like the video you, you had good validations off of or put you in a good spirit, spread the love, spread the info, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. It's all greatly appreciated. And thank you so much for coming to my channel. Y'all, I'm so sorry. I'm just getting tongue-tied, talking so fast. It's like a little, little, little bit of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, but anyway, I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and doing blessed. Um, today my video, well, actually, the music I'm listening to in the background, I'm not having hot flashes, y'all. Uh, concentration music by by binarial, binarial beats. Focus music for studying and work. Jesus, that was like a tongue twister. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's just like my words are getting you know stuck on top of each other but anyways the video that i'm doing today is twin flame 101 uh hey Oka is finding peace finding peace you know surrounding chaos you know we have to do that i mean because this is a chaotic world and you have to find peace and love in it. It's just like the other day, um, I was telling y'all about the video about the Wiccans. And, you know, I placed prosperity uh, prosperity wishes upon myself. You know, because it was just so many things that was going on around me. I felt like I was going to lose my mind, you know, helping others out. But yet I was taking on their the residue of their emotions of their past trauma. And it became too much for me. So it's just like I had to try to find ways to put myself in a give myself a peace of mind because we have to do that you have to find you know ways of uh things to put you in a peaceful place because especially with you being um being an empath boy we get it hard because it's just like we're already dealing with our situations and our energy and our aura and stuff like that and trying to maintain it you know try to stay in a positive light trying to keep ourselves on a positive path but when we have all these things that are going on around us you have to be able to watch about watch around your surroundings and it's sometimes it's hard even dealing in the workplace you have to put yourself off in a place where you you don't be around a lot of naysayers and a lot of you know complaining people because you know I, I was at that point where you know I didn't like my job and I was complaining about it too but it was just like you know you have to put your, take yourself out of situations like that you know especially if it's a job you know you have to you know on the side you know you stay at that job but you make sure you try to find another job on you know on the side you know sometimes being at hey okay sometimes it's hard to do that because there's a couple of times I don't left jobs and didn't have another job in behind you know behind it but it was always a lesson learned and it's just like you have to put yourself, you know, especially when it's around people that, you know, constantly want to just, you know, their energy is just draining. And you know you get that 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 little spider tense, you know, that spider, that tingly spider sense in your body when it's just like, you know, something's not right about this person or, 
you know, I need to not be around this person, or it just makes you want to, you know, because I about face real quick when I used to see people like, oh, hey, goodbye, you know, and be walking off like, oh, you know, like, oh, you always seem like you're on the run, because I always, always got to stay busy, 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 you know, I always try to make sure I stay busy, especially when I was around them, because I'm not trying to have that kind of energy coming around, so it's just like, when you get around things like that, you have to you know, I have to tell myself, and you know, I even tell, you know, people that I'm close to, sometimes you have to psych yourself out. You have to put yourself, you know, even if you have a meditation beat, you know, if you're at a job where you're able to listen to meditation music, you know, pull out your phone, you know, put your earphones in and just, you know, listen to positive, you know, positive vibrations, you know, bring that, that back to your life to revive yourself, get that jump start, get kick start, you know, put yourself in, in, you know, psych yourself out by putting yourself in like, you know, your favorite vacation or your, you know, your favorite pastime, you know, if you're at a job or you're, you know, if you're even at home, place with music on. Like, there's sometimes I'll clean my house. I feel so much better when I clean my house. Because <laughs> it feels like, you know, cleanliness is next to godliness. So I always try to, you know, keep myself up in good spirits. I mean, it's, sometimes it's hard to do, especially when you're you're fighting with de depression and anxiety and stuff like that. But that's when you have to push yourself and say, hey, you know what? Get up. you got to do this today. Even if it's, you know you know, vacuuming or, you know, straighten up doing dishes and stuff like that. You you put like little, you know, little to do things for yourself each, each and every day, especially when you're battling with depression, because I know that's very hard to do. Because sometimes you have to really, really motivate yourself to do things. So that's when you try to look out for things that you're talented in, things that brings light to your life, things that, you know, you like telling jokes or whatever. Go watch a comedy if you can. You know, if you like, you know, uh listening to the rain if you have a, you know a porch you know go sit on the porch and listen to the raindrops do anything that brings light to your life brings any kind of good vibrations to you but just make sure you try to be able to maintain in a chaotic world because i mean we always have to do that you have to you know psych yourself out and i was watching um a video with aphrodite stone and she was saying the same thing i said girl preach that say that speak it into existence you have to because especially when you're on that thing of you know that path of elevating you cannot be around people that suck the energy out of you bring you know just constantly dogging folks out talking about people because i mean even though some things could be funny when they bring you to tea and i just sometimes people be telling me stuff i saw i'm not about to laugh at that even though I'm laughing on the inside, I'm like, I'm not about to laugh at that because that's not funny, you know, because something, could, you, you never know, something could happen to you and it wouldn't be so funny when it happened. So it's just like when you're you're feeling that way and you feel like, oh my gosh, because the world is chaotic. You know, every time we turn around, there's shootings, there's murders, there's senseless violence that we don't even need to have. And it's just like, you have to have that mindset. If there's something that you can do to bring to the table to contribute to try to make a change, then you go forward. You do all you need to do and try to get as much people on your boat as possible to help you do that. But if there's things that you can't change and things that, you know, you, you there, there is really not doing anything, I mean, that you can contribute to, then go move on. And if you have people that are around you, like, you know, it could be co-workers or friends or relatives, if they feel like they're sucking the life out of you, I'm sorry, boo-boo, they got to go. You let them know, hey, this is what this is happening to me. This is, you know, this is what is this the situation is doing to me this is what is bringing you know is bringing me down or is making me feel a certain type of way and if they're not trying to address that or even be concerned this is something that they choose to be in so you know when they're they can't be there in that you know that dark side they they can't be there during their sunshine you know you're trying to elevate you're trying to get into that better that better light of yourself you're trying to lead by example you're trying to be that best version of yourself so it's just like when people you know people love misery you know people are comfortable with that they don't you know they don't want to change they don't want to you know excel in life okay that's fine they don't want to you send that message of you being a hell because you're mirroring what they need to do and they don't want to do it hey that's all they you only can be responsible for you God knows your heart. Like I had to tell people, I was telling my, my sister about that today. God knows your heart.
God knows, you know, when you're you're pushing out good intentions and if people don't want to help themselves, help themselves. Hey, each man, you know, each man for his own, every, every man for himself, to each his own. You have to do what you got to do, but, you know, don't lose yourself on trying to help somebody. So I hope you were able to get something out of this video. I hope you were able to it, it give you some kind of understanding, some kind of peace, some kind of validation. So in that being said, like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Send out as much love and light as possible. Know that you are blessed and prosperous and highly favored and you are truly loved. And knowing there's somebody out there praying for you that's hoping for your better days. Send out, send out as much love and light as possible like and subscribe as, as always and stay blessed be responsible and be safe and i'll see you on my next video peace and be wild